Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Prison Architect. Um, so in the last episode I got started, I kind of let you guys know what my plans were for the time being. Uh, so for this episode, we're going to be working on um, just completing some of the some of the stuff that we've uh, we've started. So first things first, um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, use some walls. Yeah, the perimeter walls are pretty expensive. I'm going to fence in this area uh, for the yard. It's not going to end up being fence. Um, that way we can actually make sure that it's officially um, a yard. And let's see how expensive... This would be 7,000. I don't know if I want to do that. Uh, what about this one? This one's going to be a lot. Yeah, 11,000. You know what? For the time being, let's go ahead and use that. Um, and that's right now, that's going to be the shower slash cantina. What do they call it here? Kitchen? Yeah. Kitchen slash canteen area. And that's going to help us uh, finish this. So then we'll need, uh, I'll make a holding cell up here. Um, a yard we'll have, a kitchen canteen, we'll have that. Two guards, two cooks, those are easy. Um, Alright, so let's get a large jail door. Let's rotate that there. And then for the future, I also am going to actually, yeah, we don't want it there. I kind of want to make it so the shower is only accessible through the yard. I know that's that's going to be bad. Oof. Yeah, that's going to be bad. I'm just trying to think of the flow of traffic for my prison. I think it would be smarter if, let's go into planning here. I think it would be smarter if this was another path. Oops, no. Uh, that needs to stay a wall. Um, I think, yeah. It would make sense if this is another pathway. Now that I'm thinking about it, it might not be a bad idea for all of these to be individual areas. And not necessarily indoors. You know what I mean? It would... Actually, it's more secure if it's indoors. So, scratch that. Um, that's what it is. Uh, but yeah. We are going to continue to build this then. Then I, I think what I'm going to do for flow of traffic's sake is we're going to have another two entrances. We're going to have a large jail door here. And also here as well, across from the cantina. All right. So cash flow, we're still making money, which is good. Um, we're gonna speed this up because there's no point to watching these guys build. Power station is good. I'm gonna need to build another power station soon the planning here goodbye this by this all right so the shower needs shower heads uh the kitchen indoor cooker fridge sink so let's go ahead and do a a room let's go ahead and cut this in half um just for the time being so we're gonna need to make a kitchen And we're also going to need to make a canteen. And we need a fridge. Which I will not be... I'm not wasting these items because we are going to need these for the rooms eventually. So fridge, cooker. I believe a sink. 
other thing. Her fridge sink. And then serving table, table bench. Bada bing. Bada boom. Uh, why can I not enter? Serving table. Bada bing. Perfect. That's done. Kitchen is done. Canteen is almost done. Shower head. We need a shower head. That's good. What is the yard? The yard needs to be secure behind at least one door. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a jail door here. And here. Is a road barrier? Oh... That's new. That's awesome. We're going to need to get that. Um, okay. Yard. We also need to material. We need to fence this area right here. Um, yard is good. We need a holding cell now. So... So... Needs... Toilet and a bench. We need a toilet and a bench. Okay, perfect. And then the shortest. We're gonna have um, bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. And then we are going to unfortunately fire that because that's gonna keep our cash flow down for the time being. Uh, we also can actually hire an accountant. It's going to drop our cash flow, but it also finishes that. So you can see just by doing these, uh, just by doing these little grants, we can make a lot of money. So it's a good start. Next thing we're going to do, uh, long-term investment. Let's see, let's do the long-term investment, which means we um do give them five thousand dollars and then we get eleven thousand dollars in return um and what does this see our prisoner capacity to 15 wow that's easy all right let's also do that perfect so what we're gonna do is okay, 167 hours that's a while um, our prisoner capacity to 15. So this was going to be our big cell area. So. You can see that's a lot of funds. But it's going to be worth it. This We basically used the grant to pay for our building. So objects. Put a large jail door here. And then let's. Alright so these are basic cells. So what exactly does this come with? Okay. Um, let's also get our utilities. Let's go ahead and get the electrical cable over here. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to build another little uh, area over here. Um, and that's going to service um, energy for these areas. Because these capacitors, I can probably do this area with this generator. But I'm going to need a second generator for this. Um, plus if one goes down, we don't want one generator to, um, to do the entire thing. Dismantle that light. Because it's not going to ever get energy. And it's just going to be blinking 24-7. Alright, so this is almost done. Chopping down some trees. We could sell that. But we'll worry about that after. Or there is a way to kind of... I don't know. 
make it a little easier for you guys to see. Let's go ahead and turn the brightness up a little bit. Nope, that doesn't help. Game, auto sign, blah, 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 audio, experimental. Oops, that was not it. Sorry about that, guys. All right, so this is good now. It should be. We just need to get them to, first off, go on full speed again. Yeah, so I'm thinking about getting some mods. Um, there's, like, some other, like, investment mods. I feel like that's pretty realistic. Um, there's also mods that uh, add cool things. For example, like... I don't know, you can make it Star Wars theme or something like that, or make it, uh, make all the, the lights look differently or something. We'll, we'll see. I'll, I'll look around and maybe next episode or, uh, next session that I film, we will, uh, we'll do this. So the cell needs to have two by three. So... A cell needs two by three. So there's a cell. 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 Oops. Silly. Nope, now I'm being extra silly. So there's gonna be... Let me just... So you guys can see what I'm planning. So there has to be walls... All of these places. Oh crap. I screwed up, boys. It's okay. Luckily, I caught it now. So, sell. We're gonna have to just go ahead and demolish these walls. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> Do you guys hear that fly flying around? Bizarre. Alright, uh, so boom, 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 boom. We have a nice little area up here. Alright, so that's good. And then we're gonna need another set of cells. Two by three. Two by three. Two by three. Two by three. And the reason I'm leaving this area is actually we can do it like this. Actually no, I wanna keep this kind of central area kind of free. annoying they used to allow you to cancel individual things but it looks like they grouped everything together now all good though i know it's a little dark um but i'm basically just gonna spend the rest of this time uh doing this mapping these bad boys out i always go for the long-term investment um uh, first, because I always try to plan stuff out like this while that's cooking. It, it just makes a lot of sense to have something long-term going while you are, you know, doing a lot of planning slash building. Alright, so now we're going to actually plop these cells down. So, objects. Where are the pre-made rooms? That's, that's pretty interesting. Quick build. I might do shared cells. Are they separate rooms? Dormitory. Ah, that's interesting. Maybe I'll make some dormitories over on this side, and that'll be like the low security prisoners. Or maybe this area can be the low security, and this can be the medium. We'll see. Um, either way, each cell needs 
Let's see. That's bizarre. Um, but each cell needs a bed, a toilet, and that's it. So we're going to give them... Oh, my game just crashed. Uh, hold on, guys. Let me reopen that. That is a little bizarre. <laughs> maybe I'll edit maybe I'll edit this out, maybe not. Um Man, that sucks. But yeah, uh Wow, that's really bizarre. Hold on one second. Alright, whatever. Uh that saves me some extra money from the mistakes I made. It's all good. Go ahead and re-put this down. Oh, okay, it's already there. Alright, um... That's fine. I'm gonna make this dormitories now. Now that I know that, that actually works out. So, the dormitories... What do they need? Minimum size, 2x3. So, let's do 4x4. Four four. And let's see what that gives us. Four by threes. Alright, I like those better. I think that's a better idea. This will be the low security area. Four by three. Four by three. Four by three. Four by three. So that's the wall. So we need another hallway here. One, two, three. Right? Is that right? This is wrong. Yeah, you guys are watching me fail at this right now. Or by three. It's all right. Man, that stinks that the game crashed. It's all right. At least you guys know what I'm, I'm planning. I'm probably not going to cut that out just because it kind of adds to... Um, it kind of adds to you getting a better understanding of my plan. Oh, remember I can't do that anymore. Go ahead and put it on three times speed as well. Plus, it shows that even if uh, something goes wrong, you can still fix it, which a lot of times I uh, I don't think about and I just get upset over. But honestly, is it really that big of a deal? Not really. Alright. Here we go. And that'll be good for this. Let's see what the quick build uh, shared cells look like. That's weird. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to objects. We're going to put a jail door. All of these. And we also need to get some concrete here. Perfect. And then we need in these... Um, bunk beds. I'm gonna put bunk beds in here. Bunk bed. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. I kind of like making them symmetrical, so... Alright, perfect. And then we also need a toilet. So we're going to put the toilets here. My money is getting pretty low, but that's okay. At the end of this, we're going to get 20000 Um, So the toilets are being added. There are no canteens accessible by this cell. That's fine. Alright. 
So another grant in the books. And let's check what the next grant's going to be. Cell block B, expand your prisoner capacity to 50. Perfect. Let's see if there's anything else that we want to do. Uh, inmate, build a medical ward, have at least two doctors. Unlock maintenance, visitation rights. Our security chief, our 10 guards. I build a classroom. Oh yeah, that's really important. We need our person to start doing this. All right. I think education's a good one too. We're gonna we're gonna save some money though. Um. All right. We need to take on cell block B. I think that's a good one. All right. So currently we have. A prisoner capacity if it's 48 percent um so we have 24 well right now so these last cells i'll make these ones bigger This, bada bing, boom, bing, bada boom, and then in these ones, let's go ahead and put bunk bed, which of these, and a second bunk bed. Um, actually. Let's go ahead and just put single beds in here instead. I don't want to put that many prisoners in there. I don't think it's the best idea. Um. All right, perfect. And then we are going to put jail doors here. All right, and this is going to do 2, 4, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's 36 people that we can hold. Um, so let's just go ahead and add more cell blocks. So rooms. Add some more dormitories. What was I doing? 4 by 3. Last, these last couple can be pretty big over here. Keep hearing sirens, but it's in the game, and I thought that it was outside. I've been hearing lots of sirens today. I saw something that was pretty bad today. I saw a cop uh, use his sirens uh, to get through a... An intersection that was turning red, and I thought that was pretty messed up. I've seen cops do that before. I'm not the biggest fan. I appreciate um, the service to us, but like abusing your power is not cool. Alright, perfect. Rooms, got dormitories, we're gonna get a bunk bed, we got four of them, and these ones I am gonna put two in, cause they're so big. Right, jail doors, bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom, 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 boom. And we got toilets. You know, I'll even give these guys two toilets.
Alright, perfect. Alright, and now, once this grant's done, we really need some, uh, some more money. Extra grant is approved, so with that extra grant, we're gonna go ahead and do the short-term investment. 71 hours is not too, too long. Um, alright. So that grant is done. Let's go ahead and sell block C. Raise your prisoner capacity to 100. That's a lot. So, what do we have here? Uh, you know what? I need to do this before I spend money. Before I spend more money. So this is going to have a large jail door around it. And it's going to need a water pump station. I need... Oh. Probably someone big enough for someone to crawl through for you. So we're gonna do that here. And then I also want a power station. We wanna put some capacitors around it. And then I want this. Go ahead and flow. I've never seen that, sorry for my silence. I'm just like, what is that? I want this to flow through here. And then these large pipes, I want them to flow like this. All right, small pipes. All right, that should be good. And then let's check the electricity here. We need to put some lights. Which runs don't have lights? Like most of these, which is good. All right, perfect. So we are looking better and better and better here. Bank loan. Mm. Mm. Land expansion. Wow. Pretty big. That is going to be way long term if I even do this for that long. Maximum capacity, 56. All right. What do I still need? No access to canteens. All right, let's go ahead and start doing some of these other ones. Cool cleanup. Remove the supply of stolen crackdown on drugs. Inmate nutrition. 
Carpentry Apprenticeship. Prisoner Manufacturing Facility. Maximum security. Increase the size of your security force. Unlock body armor. Unlock tasers. Government security. Prison maintenance. Inmate health and well-being. Alright, I think, you know what? I think this would be a good place for the... The health ward. Also check, where do I get, uh... Bulls dogs. Do I automatically have, um... Metal... I do, yes. And what is that? That's new. Barbed wire. That was stupid of me. Now I bought it. Might as well just do it. That was an expensive experiment. Oh well. Alright, uh, cell block C, blah blah blah. Let's go ahead and do the staff while being initiative. Go ahead and build a... Ah, uh, this is... Healthy. Let's go ahead and build a break room. I think what I'm going to do first, I'm going to end this episode. I gave you guys sort of a longer episode because of that glitch there in the middle. Um, but hopefully you guys enjoyed. I will be back um, shortly. I mean, for you, all you have to do is click on the next video. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much. And I will see you guys in the next episode.